Celebrity judges, not celebrity judges. Just judges. You ruined that. I did. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> okay, coming up right now, we've got brand new Bamzuki after Bamzuki. That was so rubbish. We've got our Zooks taking back. We've got Hacker Zook, Lickle Dog. Yeah. Look at it there. It's wicked, that one. Oh, that nickel me. And we've got my Zook, Massive Cow. He's not as good. He's, he's not slow, as, isn't he? He's slow. He's, he's oh. deliberate. Anyway, we'll see you right after a brand new Bamzuki with Gem and Barney. They're yeah. celebrities, but they're nice ones. Relax. Yeah. They say the middle chart is always the most difficult one. Welcome to the Middle Street Rules semi-finals, where no one is expecting an easy ride. So, who fancies a place in the grand final? <laughs> that would be uh, everyone then. So, introduce yourselves. Hey, we're Team Banters, and we're back. Hey, we're the Mean Green Team, and we mean business. Hey, we're Team Save Two Cyclops, and we're going to eat up the opposition. Hey, we're Team Domino, and we're here to stay. Street <laughs> Race selected. Maintain radio silence. He's on his way. The authorities are warning citizens to stay off the streets and to be on the alert for strange activity. Police have issued a description of an elderly man said to be extremely athletic. The man is believed to be connected with an underground organization called Bamzuki. So far, no one has been apprehended. And that's the way we'd like to keep it. From a cast of thousands, four more Zooks have made the cut. It takes skill and talent to make it to these championships. Look and learn, Zooksters. Here's the lineup. Domino, winner of Heat 4, he's speedy and spotty. Good combination. Sabertooth Cyclops, Heat 5's winner. Can Fangface do it again? Mean Green, he boss show six. So far has shown no weakness, watch him. And Bantis, here as fastest loser, but don't let that fool you, he's awesome. I tell you what, there's some quick zooks in this lineup, and Mean Green looks like the quickest as he heads into that first corner first and pulls out a lead with the three behind, all jostling for position. Domino just holding off Bantis, I think, with Sabertooth Cyclops bringing up the rear. But that means Mean Green is able to stretch his lead. Look at that for a start. These three really evenly matched. And Domino again blocking Bantis. Mean Green there streaking away. Great design. But this is where the action is. Domino just holding off Bantis with Cyclops in front. He won't let him by. But Mean Green doesn't worry about this. He comes down to the final straight. Here they come, Domino still holding off Bantis, but Mean Green's got it. Mean Green by a mile, superbly designed. They're delighted. Well, they've been here before, they know how it works. Mean Green's gonna get to choose who he faces in the next round. He wins by a country mile and heads into the arena. But back to the action, and Domino just holding off Bantis again. They've been together from the start, these three, being egged on, and Bantis has just finally got past Domino right at the death. Oh, what a great move that was. Bantis takes second. And can Domino hold off Sabertooth? He can. Ooh. So mean green in the driving seat, but can he make it count? OK, teams, you know the drill. Come with me. The Bamzuki Trophy is within your grasp, but to get your fingertips on the prize, you have to do more than simply survive. George, Mean Green won the street race. Well done. That means you get to choose your first opponents. But remember, it's the semi-finals, so there's no easy choice. Mean Green once again facing a difficult choice. What about Domino? Can't match Mean Green for speed, but what if it's Sumo? Tough call. Sabertooth turns out he is beatable, but with those teeth, he's got a chance it. Bantis, got here as a wild card, but he's such an all-round competitor, I wouldn't fancy it. But then I'm not a zoo. 
Ah, brilliant. Welcome back to the lair. Here you come, everybody. You weren't followed, were you? No? It's just that, you know, a big brother's like always watching us. I don't want to get rumbled before the big day. It's my biggest fear. Yeah, me too. Well, come on, your biggest fear is coming second. Yeah, so, at least I'm not scared of raspberry jelly. Oh, yep. Yeah. It's the way it wobbles. It's just weird. Anyway, that's not my biggest fear. What is then? Well, if you must know, it's losing my sense of humour. Can you imagine if I woke up in the morning and lost my power to entertain all my wicked jokes? Ah, oh, yes, I'm imagining it now. Right then, back to business. George, who are you going to choose? Domino. <gasps> An interesting choice. Why have you picked Domino, George? Because they're small enough and we think they may be a little bit weaker than us. So you think no matter what this contest is about to be, you think that size matters, yes? Yes. Yeah. Well, let's see if you're right, shall we? And it is Capture the Flag. And here is the oldest soup, Derek, and it'll peach you to show you how to play. Capture the Flag. It's simple. Right, Peachy? Right, Derek? Shout go to cross yeah. the bridge and collect your flag, then scuttle back home. Easy, right? Well, it would be if it wasn't for the drones. Oh, bad luck, Peachy. If you can get past them, grab the flag and return home to hoist it before your opponent, then you are the winner, my friend. Nice one, Derek. So, Team Mean Green chose Domino in Capture the Flag because apparently, Tilly, your Zook is really weak. What do you have to say about that? We may, we may be small, but we're not weak. Well, just to make things a bit more exciting, if you take a look at the drone in the middle of the course there, you see he's a bit bigger than the other two. That's because he is a super drone. The kind of zoo that would rip off your legs and use them as toothpicks. He's mean, he's evil, and he will stop you if you get in his way. So good luck. Here's round one. Mean Green up against Domino. Mean Green goes first. Domino goes second. Who's going to be able to avoid the super drone? Oh! What a start! 1 0 Mean Green. I think Domino took the scenic route there, Tilly. What happened? He just fell off and that was the end. Just sort of bailed out. He thought, it's too hard for me. Sorry, Mean Green's going to win this hands down, so I'm out of here. Well, hopefully, he'll stick around for the second round and get you some points. You ready for this? Yeah. All right. Here's round two. Well, Domino will be needing to avoid that super drone if he's going to stay in this competition. Again, Mean Green goes first. And Domino this time gets bundled over by one of the smaller drones. Don't worry about the super drone. He can't even cope with the little ones. And he's gone again. And Mean Green has got this sewn up. That's easy. You know what? If Mean Green had a specialist skill or a specialist game, Captain the Flag would have to be it. He's absolutely unstoppable at it, which means well done. Congratulations, George. You're going through to the next round. And Tilly, I'm afraid to say, as we can all see, I think Domino flipped right down there off the bridge again, so it's to be seen no more. Well, we're going to bring him back ready for the Eliminator. Sorry about that. Well, you know what they say. Treat them mean, keep them green. Ignoring the fact that you find yourself so funny, why would your ha-ha just disappear? I don't know, it's a freakish thing, but it can happen, Jen. It could happen tomorrow. It could happen today. i better start using my best material. Let me think about that for a while. OK, Thomas, you're going head-to-head -head with James. One of you's going out. One of you's going through. How do you feel about that? I feel very confident. Confident? You're going to win, are you? Yeah. James? Also very confident. OK. Sabretooth Cyclops, Bantis, good luck. Let's play. This is the makings of a classic. Round one. How are they going to deal with the Super Drone? They both go at the same time, and look at that. Sabretooth gets clobbered by the small drone, which leaves the big one for Bantis, but he's dealt with it brilliantly and has captured his flag first. Sabretooth is nowhere. Can Bantis get back and avoid the Super Drone? No, he can't, but he's clambered over the top of him. Great play. 1-0. I have to say, I'm slightly surprised at that result there, but you must be happy with that, James. Yep. Thomas, how's that affected your confidence? Well, I'm still very confident. You're going to bring it back. We're going to see a fight. Yeah. You want to be in that final? Yes. All right, then. Let's see it. Here's round two. 
Well, Sabretooth is going to have to look for the gaps because he didn't deal very well with the drones first time round. <laughs> Away goes Vantis. Here comes Sabretooth. Can they both head to the Super Drone? Vantis going over the top, but Sabretooth getting caught. Oh, Vantis has got his flag first again. Where's Sabretooth? Well, Sabretooth seems to have got himself caught without any trouble from the drones. What's he doing there? It's his teeth. His teeth have got him caught. And that means Vantis can surely get back. But Vantis now on top of the Super Drone. Sabretooth getting involved. This is carnage. And, and Sabretooth takes the easy way out. And jumps off! Unbelievable! Surely that means Vantis has got it won, but he's making a meal of it with a final drone, and it's even dry. What is it for these semi-final games? These are just getting so tense, but James, congratulations, you have won the second round, which means you are going through. Well done. Well done yes. to you, Vantis, and save it to the Cyclops. What happened? You know, I think you just fell off the table, got a bit too excited. Yeah, it's easy to get excited in the semis. I'll tell you what, I can cheer you up, Thomas. Yeah, you'll, you'll like this. That's one of my... Yeah. So, um... Did you hear about the bald guy who drew rabbits on his head? Yeah, he was just counting the hairs. How did you know that? It's easy. See, it's happening already, I'm losing... Right, that's it, I'm gonna pull the big boys out now, you watch. Looking forward to that, Barney. Meanwhile, Bantis is through, Sabretooth heads for the Eliminator. <laughs> Pressure Pusher is the ultimate test of Zook and Zookster. Shout attack, attack to push the barrel into your opponent's heart and retreat to return home. Pick your moment and attack again. Attack! To win, the barrel must be over the line and you must be safe on your side. Get caught in your opponent's zone when the klaxon goes and you're out. Simple, eh? Well, it would be if you knew how much time you had. Teams, it is literally crunch time. Nervous? Mm -hmm. A little bit. <laughs> well, Domino, Sabretooth Cyclops, you are playing for a place in this semi-final. If you win, you're going through. If you lose, you're going on tour with Elvis. Are you ready? Let's play. Pressure push. Well, the pressure is high. The stake even higher. One of these suits is going out. Who's it going to be? They both attack the barrel. Look, Sabretooth designed well there, pushing it much better than Domino, who's up on his back legs and struggling a bit. He's nearly tipping over. In fact, he's, he's jumping around. Disaster for Domino. Sabretooth, though, doesn't want to get caught there, wants to retreat, which he has done, giving Domino the chance to push the barrel back. He's managing it, even though he's sort of tipping up a little bit. Sabretooth now attacks the barrel. Domino jumping all over the place, he retreats, he's retreated quite early. Sabretooth has the barrel firmly in Domino's heart. Well, they think time might be up. Are they going to call him back? Checking the watch. If he gets caught there, he's in trouble, but Domino's in no position to push the barrel at the moment. He's finally retreating. If it ends now, it's all over for Domino. And it does! And it is! Domino has fallen. I tell you what, Thomas, you were in that half for a long time, then it could have been a different result, but luckily on the day, Sabretooth Cycles performed well. You are still in the game. Well done. Tilly, that means you and your team are taking Domino to elimination. <laughs> Domino, we've come to the end of the road. You've had a fantastic journey, but now chill out and let off some steam. Oh, dear. Domino's not feeling too well, but you know what? You've done so well to get through to the semi-finals, you know. You were on a roll. Now you're on a roller. Oh, dear. Ah, I mean... <laughs> Yeah, OK. Do you know what? I think those eliminations are probably a Zook's worst fear. Do you know what? I didn't... Apparently they do. Dr Vigo knows all about it. We all get scared. Life can be frightening sometimes, whether it's spiders, the dark, flying, or, or clowns with their freaky faces smiling. Always smiling! We all have something which gives us the creeps. Now, don't tell them that I told you, but there is something which Zooks would prefer to avoid at all costs. Zooks hate water. Apparently, it is something to do with the way it reacts with their exoskeleton. But believe you me, you do not want to get caught out in the rain with your little buddy. Mm. Now, as we all know, the beast here is the biggest, bravest, super coolest Zook in the whole of town. And yet, between you and me, even Beastie here is a bit of a scaredy Zook when it comes to the old wet stuff. Just watch. Hey, Beast! Beast! 
You don't mind if I give my plant here a little bit of a spray with water, do you? He looks very dry. <laughs> oh, beastie, come on. Don't hide. Look, I put it down. You can trust me. I'm the world's most famous zoologist. Ah, uh, make it look. <laughs> Beef. Look, don't worry, I put it down. I put it down. Beast, I'm just kidding. Come on, beast. Beast. <laughs> Wow! Fifteen all, Beastie. Fifteen all. Don't mess with the beast, Figo. Mean Green earlier showed why he's known as the king of the streets with another blistering road race. He then picked Domino and left him for dead in the flag. In the other shootout, Sabretooth went up against Bantis and came off second best. So it was Teeth versus Spots in the Eliminator. Sabretooth won and Domino got flattened. <laughs> Barney, I heard a rumour that you are scared of water. <laughs> Implying that I don't wash. Hey, <laughs> you're funny. Not out of the jokes, thank you very much. Right then, time trials, teams. Let's see what we're playing. Ah, I hope your zooks have got their trainers on. It's Raid Runner. This game requires speed, agility, and quick thinking. Make like a turkey and gobble, gobble, gobble those points before Senti is released and hunts you down. Easy. Direct your zook by naming the colours, but don't get caught. The winner is the zook who gets the most points in the quickest time. Do you reckon when zooks go to sleep and try and imagine imaginary or virtual sheep? Uh, no, they dream of victory. Ah, well, I hope your zooks have had plenty of sleep, teams, because this is about to get tough. Got Mean Green up first. George, are you ready to raid? Yes. Are you ready to run? Yes. Let's play. <laughs> well, the one thing Mean Green has got is outright speed, and surely that's going to be important once right. Senti is released. In the meantime, can we get a load of points? Oh, can't quite right. get through there. The gate preventing him, but in the red zone, picks up those points. Blue. Heads back to blue, no points to be had there. Blue. On to the next blue, again, no points there, but at least he's far away from Senti. Will surely be released any second now. Here he comes, <laughs> sniffing him out. And Mean Green is trapped, but at least Green. he's the other end of the board. But here comes Senti. Mean Green trying to Green. get away, but the gates closed. It opens. He uses his speed to go away. But it hits Green. round and straight into Senti. Gets him by the throat. Well, that looked okay, George. A good performance. How do you think you've done? I'm not quite sure. See how the other teams do. Yeah, and of course you are fighting here for your place in the finale. So good luck with it. Let's see how the next team does. OK, Mike, it's time for you and Bantis to show us what you can do in Raid Runner. Now, here's the deal. If you beat Mean Green's score, you're going through. If you don't, you're not so sure. Are you ready? Yep. Let's play Raid Runner. How will Bantis compare to Mean Green? And how will Red. Bantis cope with Senti? Yeah. He's got himself right in the middle yeah. there. And a bit caught on one of the gates. Frees himself, gets a couple of points. Gets to that blue zone, a couple more points. Blue with those next two. Gets them, that's good play. They move Bantis to green, Bantis sort of hugging the edge of the playing area, almost as if he's trying to get as far away from Senti as possible, which is what he needs to do now, because here comes Senti. He sensed him out and he's gone straight for him. That's all over for Bantis. No messing from Senti. And time is up for Bantis. Mike, how do you think you've done? All right, could have done better. Do you think you've done enough to stay in the game? Maybe. Well. There's only one way to find out, and it all hangs on round three. Dom, it's never easy to step up to a game last, because you've seen how the first two zooks have performed. You now know what you've got to do to secure your place in the finale. To make it more difficult, we're going to add another four centres to this game. I'm only kidding, but if you lose, it's the end of the world. Good luck. Let's play. Well, Sabretooth. Got to pull it out of the bag here. A nice, confident call. Off he goes. He's 
got himself caught there on a the gate with those teeth. I don't really know what part those teeth play in his design, really. What use they actually are. He's got a couple of points there. Edge to red. Picks up those points. That's good play. Back to blue. And blue again. That's excellent play. Racking up the points here, Sabretooth. This is a good performance, but it could be about to end because here comes Senti, sensing him out. Oh, Sabretooth gets caught. Heads to green. Oh, great play. A stay of execution. Oh, but not for long. Senti hunts him down. Sabretooth Cyclops, what a game. Dominic, do you think you've done enough? Definitely. Definitely? You're very confident? Yes. OK, well, we need to find out then, don't we? Yeah, you're making me nervous talking like that, but let's find out, shall we? Mean Green 14, Bantis 13, Sabretooth with 17. It means it's bye-bye, Bantis. Well, fellas, you rocketed onto our screens. As far as team members go, you really are a set of sparklers. You've played some fire-cracking games, but now you're going out with a bang. <laughs> oh. Everyone likes fireworks, don't they? And it's, it's even funnier when your zoot goes up on one. Are you happy about that? Yep. Yeah. You've got to the semis, you've enjoyed yourselves? Yeah. Cheers, fellas. Now, I think old Dr Vigo's going a bit gaga. Who is he catching up with? It's a mega celeb. That's... It's that time again when I take questions from celebrity Zook fans and I am super excited because now on the line I have got Mrs. Lady Gaga. Ah, oh, hello. Ah, oh, hello. Ah, uh, 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 hello, Dr. Vigo. Hello, good to see you. Wow. Is it really you, Mrs. Lady Gaga? Well, of course it's really me. Don't you recognise my, um, my poker face? You look a little different. Well, uh, uh, Dr. Vigo, I was hoping you'd let me rejoin, uh, I mean, uh, join the exclusive club that, you know, we both know all about. Look, I've even bought my own Zook. There he is. Ah, oh, nice to meet you, little Zook. Wait a minute. That Zook looks just like Bernard, the Zook of ex-BAM Zooki presenter Jake Humphrey. In fact, thinking about it, you look a lot like Jake Humphrey. <sighs> OK, all right. I am Jake Humphrey, the original presenter of Bamzuki, and, yes, that's Bernard, the original Zook. But listen, Dr Vigo, we miss you guys. We love Bamzuki. It's such a cool club to be in, and we want to be back in. Can we rejoin, please? Jake, I have told you before, Rule 506 clearly states that there is no guaranteed re-entry into Bamzuki. Mm -hmm. Look, you have made your Formula One bed. Now you must lie in it. Oh, but Dr. Vigo... He's always bothering me. And me, Vigo. I've had to change my mobile number. Earlier, Mean Green showed pace, then strength the streak straight through to the second level. What a thoroughbred. Sabretooth got a wake-up call from Bantis and captured the flag, but made good in the pressure pusher and showed Domino his fangs. The experience must have done him good as he kept his cool and scored a mighty 17 points in Raid Runner, sending Bantis home early and setting us up for a fang-filled finale. OK, teams, we're heading to the rooftops once again. This time, though, the stakes are a bit higher. You know what it's all about. It's level three. Now, one of your Zooks will be going through to the grand final. The other Zook... Well, won't. So, hold on to your heads there. You've got some gaming to do first. This is rooftop warfare. Street rules apply. Down there, you can see the finale that will test you to your Zuki limits. I really don't know how to call this one. It's getting harder and harder the closer we get to the grand final. Um, OK, let's go over it. Um, Sabretooth Cyclops is quite fast, quite strong. Um, I don't know. What do you think? Uh, I think it's going to be a very close one. I think we've got two equally matched Zooks here. It could really go either way. Mean Green, what do you reckon? Well, we reckon we're quite confident because we thrashed the last team we faced on this challenge. This is true, but you're up against a very different Zook. That's true, isn't it, Thomas? Yeah, we think we're going to win this one. What do you think you've got that's uh, your strength? Oh, we're really good against all the little snap tracks and the cloth eye. OK, well, the cloth eye, of course, are the big scary ones. So, for a place, in the grand final, let's do battle. 
This is an intriguing finale. Sabertooth Cyclops up against the much quicker Mean Green, but it's Mean Green who finds himself in second place as they go up the ramp and into the sliding doors. An early lead for Sabertooth Cyclops. He's through the doors and Mean Green's got caught. How is Sabertooth going to deal with Ariel Alley? Well, brilliantly, he's through before all the poles are finished falling and a healthy lead. Can Mean Green close it down? Up to the boulders goes Sabertooth Cyclops. Deals with him okay, but gets pushed back. Mean Green's got closer. Sabertooth's got stuck on the boulder. And Mean Green flew into the lead and through the Staple Jacks. Can Sabertooth get through? Oh, Mean Green heads into the first Colossus. He gets caught. Sabertooth's on his way. But Mean Green's through the first one. He's through the second one. And he is a winner. Mean Green first. Two second are getting clobbered for his trouble. There you have it, a very clear winner. Congratulations, Mean Green. You are joining Correlationis in the grand final. Well done. In the end, Mean Green goes through, Sabretooth proving toothless. Well, you lost out in this finale, but you could still make it to the grand final if you are one of our fastest losers. Let's have a look at the scoreboard. Only the fastest loser will go through. Armed response currently there with 48.7. Saber Tooth isn't quick enough. <laughs> Sorry. But hey, you wanted to be on telly, maybe that just wasn't the outcome you're after. Hey Mimi, I've got one for you. What do you call a vicar on a motorbike? Rev. <laughs> Gem, you've stolen my sense of humour. Oh, I didn't do it on purpose. Hey, that means that I'm the funny one and you are the... The, the good-looking one with, with the talent? I know, it's embarrassing, but well, one of us has to have it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what? don't forget, there's only one more semi-final to go. It's going to be an epic, so for all things Zookish, get onto the website, you'll find all the info you need there. So, which show rules? Black Zuki Street rules! Right, that's it. Can you get my agent on the phone? Everyone wants to be a part of our club. Even celebrities are desperate to join Banzuki. Have you seen all the celebs with their zooks? Go on, have a look. See if you can recognize their faces. Getting to know your mom. We're not literally fighting each other. No, you got to block it. Getting to know your dad. What are you touching us? What? Getting to know yourself. This is going to be tough. I would like to show everyone that I can do it. Mastering the ancient Japanese art of karate in just three weeks. Oh! High Karate, Journey to Japan. Yay! Thursdays at 5.15, the CBBC channel. Stop that, stop that now. Right. You see that? You see? Jake Humphreys there. I told him. Zuki. Yeah, more celebrities. Hey, oh. you can't ban them. You can't move no. for celebrities in the CBBC today. I'm going to ban them. No. But right now, we're, we're banning celebrities today, but right now, we're, we promised you a Zook battle earlier on, didn't oh. we? Me and Hacker love Bam Zuki, don't we? Yeah, and I love it here. You do, and we've created our own Zooks. Oh. And we've been battling, haven't we? Yeah. Last week was the first battle. I won. <coughs> Currently, I win a leading 1-0. In your face, little it's man. It's gonna change today. Well, we've got another challenge coming up. It's a battle. It's a, ch a challenge of speed, this one, isn't it? Yeah, it's I'm gonna win. Zook tag, and it's a, ch it's a speed and agility, isn't it? That is me. <laughs> yeah, this is quite fast. Hacker's Zook is called Little Dog. Yeah. It's pretty fast. It's pretty agile. It gets about. And there's also my Zook, 
massive cow. Oh, Ian! It's not very fast and he's not particularly agile. But it is a massive yeah. cow. He's pretty much the underdog, but hopefully he'll come through. Do you want to see the battle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going down, little man. No, I'm not. Let the battle commence. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Lick a dog. Oh, what's happening? Lick a doggy winning. Come on, Mazin. Get him out. Come on. No. Yes. No. Yes. Good too. Oh, he's going to win. No. <laughs> you massive cow. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, that's great.